Armstrong. Trucked off by Adams. Merson. Hartson. Merson wants it back. Merson gets it back. Early ball for Bergkamp. Brilliant play from Arsenal. Absolutely brilliant goal. The signs were there. They were putting their passes together. But they haven't really looked like penetrating. They have done now after 14 minutes. And Tottenham ripped apart here. Often Arsenal known for their tenacity rather than their technique. But this was stunning play. A superb finish. And Dennis Bergkamp, the boyhood Spurs fan, makes the current Spurs fans uh, disheartened here. It's Tottenham nil, Arsenal one. Three up for Tottenham. Arsenal have three, now four back. Fox. It's gone in from Teddy Sheringham. Despite the efforts of Adams, despite the efforts of Seaman. And Spurs have struck back after 29 minutes. Seconds after they were defending an Arsenal corner. But Fox got his cross in. And Sheringham stooping there. It looked for a second as though Seaman had saved it. But he hadn't. In towards Sheringham again. Well read by Adams. Ooh, Winterburn took a risk with a pass into that area. And the pass was a fine one as it turned out. And Arsenal haven't been able to recapture, really, the uh, rhythm that they showed in the opening 20 minutes of the game. Armstrong. Chris Armstrong for Tottenham. Tottenham have taken the lead. A magnificent piece of play from the scorer. in the 10th minute of the second half. A match that started badly for Spurs, but has a much rosier hue to it now. He picked his way round Steve Bold, did Chris Armstrong, and fired it into the corner. That was Gazelle. Shape of the game suiting Spurs, you sense at the moment. They're drawing Arsenal forward and making opportunities on the break Fox oh Seaman slipped on oh, recovered somehow when Sheringham came diving in Seaman stuck out of foot having lost his footing a moment earlier down he went up he got 